Good morning, so it's Tuesday morning, um, oh you'll have to excuse my hair, I've not long been out of the shower and it's just drying, drying quite naturally. Um, I've been doing some freelance work this morning, so pretty standard morning so far. Um, now the kids are getting dressed and um, I think we're going to go out for some lunch. I'm not really feeling like making anything, which is super lazy, I know, but I think we're going to head out and get something to eat and then um, come back and pack, which seems to be the pretty standard setup for this week. Um, probably not much is going to change there, I'm afraid. But yeah, going to get on with some work, maybe got half an hour's more work to do and then we'll go out for some lunch. Okay, Eli, so this is your outfit choice for the day, right? Yeah! So you have on your red football kit with a sleeveless sports vest on the top a wooden sword and your Robin Hood hat, is that correct? Yeah. And um, and what are you being today? Luke in belt. Luke in belt, is that like puss in boots? Mm -hmm. Because you haven't got any boots on. Mm -hmm. Yeah? <laughs> I've just ordered myself um, a camera for vlogging. Um, I've been saving and saving from all the work that I've been doing. Um, and I finally had enough to order the camera and I feel so ill by the amount of money that I have just spent so I really hope that A it arrives um, and B that it's worth the money that I've just spent because I've literally just dropped nearly £500 on a camera just like that and uh, now I feel quite ill. So this sucks but I have got a killer headache, um, the air pressure today it has just been absolutely insane it's so muggy and it keeps threatening rain and then not really raining and it's so it's, it's really warm and muggy outside um but right across the bridge of my nose i've just got the biggest headache and it's forecast to have a thunderstorm later so i'm hoping that that actually happens oh gosh look at my double chin because i'm lying down um yeah i'm hoping that happens and breaks the pressure because at the moment I'm not managing to do anything except lie on the sofa and feel super sorry for myself which is obviously not very productive when we move in just a few days so um, I really need the weather to break. I literally have no words for this bedroom Eli. What on earth has happened in here? You got messy? Did you? I think that is an understatement somehow. Oh my goodness. Beep, beep, beep. Living inside a feet country. We move to. You've got dirty feet, Eli. Beep. Yes, I have got dirty feet. So I've just come off the phone with James. He's up at the new house today. He's taking out the rest of the kitchen and pulling up the kitchen floor so that the new tiles can go down this week. And he has a friend who is an electrical engineer and he came out to look at the possibility of moving the light switches in Eli's room. And I think as a courtesy, he kind of went around the whole house and just checked out the electrics. Anyway, the long and short of it is that the electricity, the electrics has been rewired um, downstairs but they haven't touched upstairs and the wiring upstairs is not safe, particularly in Eli's room there is a light fitting which is actually um, incredibly dangerous. So um, he is coming back next week on Tuesday um, but basically he's going to have to pull up the floor in our bedroom and um, so he's gonna have to take up the laminate and pull up the floorboards in order to fix what has been done dangerously in Eli's room so that kind of means that we're gonna have to not put all our stuff into our room um, and also think about replacing the floor in the loft conversion as well which is just something that was way way down on the bottom of the list but if we're pulling up the laminate it's very likely that it's gonna get damaged so I just feel like I don't know what we're going to do. Um, we're going to have to move in on Saturday. The kids won't be able to get into their rooms. They were going to have to sleep in the playroom. 
um, we haven't been able to get in touch with a plasterer. We've been trying for the last week to call the plasterer who said he was going to come out this week and he just isn't responding. So I don't know even whether we're going to be at the stage where we can decorate their kids' rooms anyway. Um, and now we're not going to be able to go into our room because on Tuesday, there's no point putting all the furniture into our room because on Tuesday the floor has got to be ripped up and replaced. So, and then if it takes this guy longer than um, he thinks to do the rewiring, then we could potentially not have our room for more days than just one. Um, so yeah, I just, I feel like every time we peel back a layer of this house, we discover something else that's not been done well or just has been patched up and it's just a little little bit stressful may have shouted a fair bit down the phone at James out of frustration and it's not his fault of course it's not his fault that these people have not rewired their house properly but it is just another thing to think about another thing to somehow try and budget for you know if we've got to replace the floor in our room that's something else that we were planning to do that we now can't do because the money is not limitless um so yeah a little bit stressed this evening tiny bit stressed <laughs> don't know what I'm gonna do with myself I might try and watch some tv I feel like I should pack but now I just can't be bothered I just feel um I just feel anxious about the house and that doesn't really make me want to do anything so I might try and read or I might just try and watch some trashy tv <laughs> Finally got all the units out. We've got the laminate up, we've got the cupboards out. And um, I'm just trying to take off these horrible vinyl floor tiles. I'm gonna, I'm gonna show you. So, this lovely blue plastic, but look how much adhesive's on the back. And um, they're just splitting and crumbling. They're so brittle and old that uh, when you try and scrape them up, they just crumble into bits. And it's uh, very annoying and I'm knackered. So this is what, um, this is what I'm trying to get up. And they just, Nightmare. Thankfully, it's only under where the old units were. But still, it's going to take me ages. Hey. But hey ho, back on with it. Yes. Finally. It is done.